Yes, sir. Could you, um, peace, peace, Lord. Peace, peace. Uh, could you probably introduce yourself to the audience? My name is Ali Mardin Mohammed. I'm the field supreme minister for the New World Nation of Islam. Uh, we would like to start the interview. Can you describe the people, the places, and the culture of North in your pre nation of Islam days?
Yeah, uh, that's the teachings of the Honorable Elijah Muhammad. He said, well, I can't stay right now. He said, but Rudy, why don't you bring him around to the temple? You know, I had asked him, I said, where did you get this stuff from? So he said, uh, uh, this is the teachings of the Honorable Elijah Muhammad. He said, uh, we, 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 we learned this at the temple. So I said, well, can I come to the temple? He said, sure, you can come to the temple. I said, how much it costs? He said, don't cost nothing. He said, Rudy. So when you come around to the temple, bring the brother with you. So that was how I woke up. Uh, I did go with Rudy uh, to 13th Court Street. And uh, that's the most sense. Okay. Now, 13th Court Street was where the Nation of Islam was meeting here in North New Jersey for the services. But also part of the history in North that's unorthodox is that there was something called the Council that existed in the city of Newark. Can you talk about who and what was the council and their methodology as far as fishing and bringing people over into the teachings of Adam Elijah Muhammad? Uh, yeah, uh, the council basically was the, the few brothers that was on the scene at that time. It was, uh, like I said, 12 brothers. I came on the scene, I made 13. And we used to meet at 13th Court Street. Now, I don't know how council came about, the name council came about, but they did refer to themselves as the council. And whenever we had guests who wanted to hear the teachings of the Honorable Elijah Muhammad, one of the members of the council would do the teaching. Now, without mentioning names, uh, pretty much the head of the council acted as the minister. And the other brothers took up duties ranging in rank. Like we had uh, captains and lieutenants in the council. You see. So they actually had a, 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 a unofficial staff who started the teaching because this staff was not put together by the Honorable Elijah Muhammad. This was just a group of brothers who got together and started teaching. And then when they began to see that they were successful in raising people, when they got a pretty, you know, good number. Then they began to try to contact Temple Seven, uh, Chicago, to see what can be done in regards to establishing our own temple. But the council was self-appointed. The council was not uh, appointed by the messenger. It's just a group of brothers that got together, and because they began to teach, and people began to stand up, they decided they would meet at 13th Court Street, and that the brothers who was present was counsel. Mm -hmm. That's how that 